The John S. McCain Jr. ROTC Leadership Competition is about discipline, values, and patriotism. This annual high school competition in Phoenix is about helping youth learn critical life skills that will help them in the future. Eight Arizona high school teams participated in this year's competition. We've been doing it five years. This is not about marching. We call it leadership competition because it does take leadership to get involved in our JROTC high school programs. It's about inspiring our youth. No intent for them to get into the military. If they do, that's great. But it's teaching them about teamwork, responsibility, and leadership. Thank you, Post 41! The Tony of Sosa Rey Martinez American Legion Post 41 is a veteran service organization built by Latino veterans. The organization's leadership believes in mentoring youth and supporting programs that help improve the quality of life for veterans, their families, and community. Post 41 is uh, one of the iconic American Legion posts uh, in Phoenix. And when, you he when you're here and you go into the museum and you just look at the rich history that our community, that our state has provided, it just reminds you of everyone who's come before and so doing this where you're bringing the young folks in and they're getting to see and walk around and be part of this amazing piece of history, uh, really special. Order! Arms! Order! Courage! Commitment! Hoorah! The John S. McCain Junior ROTC Leadership Competition helps high school students understand the benefits of the Reserve Officer Training Corps. It is a program that provides students with structure, discipline, values, and leadership skills. Through the ROTC program, students can train to become officers in the United States military. They learn the benefit of setting a goal and going to achieve that goal, and they get comfortable with the fact that Sometimes they're going to achieve that goal and sometimes they're going to come really close, sometimes not so good, but they're going to learn from that experience and get better the next time. Oh, it's fantastic to see them participating. They practice, they practice, and they practice, and they try hard, and they're going to show up and they're going to be judged, and they're going to be comfortable being judged. And it just means a tremendous amount for the students to, to be able to participate under pressure and perform. Um, ROTC just kind of spoke to me. It just kind of, it was on the... Thing, list of classes to pick, looked into it, and it just sounded really interesting, and I've been with it since. Why is it interesting? Uh, I think it just the mission behind it, uh, what we do every day, it really puts us in a good position for the rest of our lives. I want to learn more about the military and probably after high school go into the military, uh, the Army. And I believe after a few years in ROTC, I can go in as an E3. So. Just give me a head start in the military. The annual John S. McCain Junior ROTC Leadership Competition begins with a civic test that includes 50 questions. Dead rest. There's a four-person armed drill, a four-person unarmed drill, 10-person armed exhibition, a 10-person unarmed drilled exhibition, 30 seconds. And the physical fitness test. Come on, you can do this. Well, we are all part of our Glendo NJROTC team. This is our exhibition team. Today is the John McCain exhibition drill meet. We've been practicing for a few weeks, and I'm pretty confident we're going to do well today. I am trying to accomplish like like some personal goals, like self-discipline. Uh, I want to like become like better. Uh, a person being disciplined here and also like knowledge because I want to go in the Navy after high school. Uh, it makes me feel really proud to be able to work with uh, Post 41 and to work with the leadership here and to just spend time uh, with these kids and with the instructors who again are, are just uh, making a difference. These kids are going to be the leaders of the future. That's what's really important and it's fun to see them now doing these, doing these, making these commitments and just thinking about what the future can hold. It was in 2017 that the Tony F. Sosa, Ray Martinez, American Legion Post 41 began the John S. McCain Junior ROTC Leadership Competition. Since then, participation of young female cadets 
has continued to grow. This is my second year of JRTC and I've found a great passion in it. The ideas that everything centered around being a leader is important to me because how are we going to set the example for the students and kids around us, even adults, if we don't know how to be a leader. And so that's really important to me. And um, the military is really big on these sorts of values and I really like that about it. Uh, the young ladies are really stepping up across the board, across the country. Uh, it's very impressive. Uh, about a third of our NGROTC units in uh, Glendale Union High School District are going to be the ladies. But what you're going to find is they're disproportionately represented in leadership. The award ceremony is the final phase of the John S. McCain Annual Junior ROTC Leadership Competition. All cadets receive a medal for their participation. Teams with the highest competition scores receive trophies and money. Fourth place, $500. Third place, $1,000. Second place, $1,500. And first place, $2,000. For the $2,000 check, Sawarita! It is with the support of volunteers and sponsors that the Tony F. Sosa Ray Martinez American Legion Post 41 honors John S. McCain, a great American hero, with this annual Junior ROTC Leadership Competition in Phoenix, Arizona. Thank you.